Hello. What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's Cora. So for today's video, we are finally in the back to school season. Woo! I'm so excited for this because back to school season is YouTubers favorite season ever, or at least it is my favorite season ever. I get to make a ton of back to school videos, which is so fun, but the fact that I'm actually going back to school is not that fun. I'm not very excited about it. But regardless of that, I'm really excited for our back to school videos. I didn't really make a lot last year because I had a lot going on at that time, but this year I'm going to be on my grind and try to make as many back to school videos as I can for you guys because I know that you guys will most likely really like them. So in today's video, we are going to be going back to school shopping. Finally, I'm so excited. Shopping is my favorite activity. If you know me, all I do is spend money. So shopping is just another time for me to spend money that I don't need to be spending. So we're going to be going to Target and then also a couple of actual clothing stores. I know we're going to be going to Target first because I have to go school supply shopping, which is something I actually need to do. Where as a clothes, I just want to do that. I don't actually have to do that. Oh my god, it is so hot in here. Sorry, let me just turn on the AC real quick. Oh my god, that feels so good. I was literally having a heat stroke, but I was pretending like I wasn't because I wanted to make the video better. Okay, so let's go to Target, but before that, obviously, we gotta go to Dunkin'. If you know me, you know that I'm obsessed with coffee. I stand Dunkin' over Starbucks any day. I'm sorry, Starbucks. Dunkin' is the OG. Back to school shopping. Woo! Okay, let's go. Back to the AC. Thank God. Hi, can I get a medium caramelized coffee with cream and sugar? Medium caramelized coffee with cream and sugar, you said, right? Yeah. I'll see you up front. Thank you. One reason Dunkin' is better than Starbucks is because there's never a line. I just drove right up, folks, and that's the tea. Thank you so much. Thank you. Wow, Dunkin' is just so incomparable to anything else. Like, it's just so much better than the workers. They're just so sweet, so. Oh. Cheers to that, am I right? Ugh. Okay, I just got to Target and I'm about to go in. I actually did make a list of everything that I need to get. And surprisingly, I do have a lot of stuff at home. So this isn't gonna be like a ginormous haul. Or so I thought. The things that I have on my school supplies list are a planner, tape, gum, oil blotting sheets, which if you know, you know. Pens, hand sanitizer, and then room decor if I see anything that I want for my room this year at school. That's all I pretty much need. Oh, and I need pencils, but I do have notebooks and folders at my house already. We have like a stash at home because my mom went and bought a ton when they were on sale after the school year had already started last year. So I'm set on notebooks and folders, but that is all the stuff that I need. So we're gonna go head in. But I'm gonna switch over to vloggy on my phone because I will have extreme social anxiety if I start vlogging on my camera on there because that is not easy to do. And if you do that, props to you. So I'm gonna mask up. Look at this cute mask that my mom got me off Etsy. I think I told you guys that in my last video. Let's go in and get some school supplies. Looking for me to let's go. Take me on this journey home. I don't wanna wait no I found a whole new section of planners and this is not a good thing. I just spent like 20 minutes trying to pick out the right planner. We could be dancing in the stars. We could be floating on a lake. As long as somehow I found myself in the decor section. So matter where we stand, don't pass space. Space makes me sad. Cause almost have everything I need. I need to get gum and then I also want to look for a floating shelf which I didn't write on my list but now I realize that I really want it. So I'm gonna try to find a white floating shelf but if they don't have it I'll probably just order it online. <laughs> Okay, 
I just got back and I'm about to head over to Marshall's real quick and then I have to go to my house to drop all this stuff off before I have a Zoom meeting for my job. Should I do like a mini haul real quick? I think I should before I go. So I'm not gonna show you guys everything because I am gonna be doing a what's in my backpack video for the back to school series. But I am gonna show you the stuff that I got for my house that I'm gonna be living in and things like that. So first I got this little thing which I think is so cute. I saw one of these on World Market I think and it was so expensive but this is literally $5 in the dollar section so I had to get it and then I got a planner the one that I was going to get was a bigger size one and it was $28 when I went to go check out so I went back and I got this one instead it's honestly the exact same thing but a mini version this will be my what's in my backpack but I guess this is a little sneak peek and then I just got a few different sized bowls. This is also for my house because I have no dishes or silverware. Actually, my roommate's bringing silverware, but these are going to be my dishes for my house. I also have plates, but I don't know where they are. And then I just got some gum, which will also be in my What's My Backpack. And then here I got some command hooks, which will also be put up decor in my room. I got another set of the exact same ones. And then I also got some bigger ones and some tiny ones to hang up some fairy lights in my room. And then I just got some tape because I literally use this all the time and I never had any last year. So I always had to borrow my roommates. And then I got this really cute stapler because I also had to borrow my roommate's stapler all the time last year. And this is just so cute. It was definitely really overpriced but I think it's adorable I love gold it's one of my favorites as you can see with my earrings and then I got these cups to match the bowls and then here are the matching plates as well and then lastly I just got this huge hanging plant it's not hanging I don't know why I said hanging but it like hangs off the edge so I'm hoping to put this on this floating shelf that I got I'm not gonna bring it all the way over here but it's literally just the threshold brand floating shelf and it's just plain white and it's 36 inches long so I got the biggest one they had because I want to put some plants on it and then also some pictures so that is my Target haul as you can see my receipt is astronomical the volume inside of this bus is astronomical and I was in there for way 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 too long so I also embarrassed myself multiple times because I was filming and people were staring at me but you know what it's fine this isn't new this is just my daily life embarrassing myself for the video so make sure to give it a like because I embarrass myself in public I am literally sweating if you guys take a look at the thumbnail, you will see that I mostly embarrassed myself taking that thumbnail. I put a video on my Snapchat story. If you have me on Snapchat, you would see some behind the scenes. Yeah, so that's me embarrassing myself while eight people stared at me taking that thumbnail when my camera was on a ginormous tripod. That is pretty much it for the Target haul. I'm gonna run over to Marshall's, like I said earlier. It's already three o'clock. I have a meeting on Zoom at 4.30, so I'm gonna head over to Marshall's, probably shop around a little bit, and then I'm gonna go home, drop all the stuff off, and then we're gonna go thrifting later, so it's gonna be fun, and there will be a haul later of all the stuff that I thrifted. Let's get to moving and grooving. On another note, I really want to know how many of you guys are actually going to be in class this upcoming semester for school. I'm going to be a junior in college, which if you don't watch my videos, you wouldn't know. I actually just got an email saying two out of my five classes are going to be online for this semester. So many people are just going to get corona and then I think they're just going to move it back to online. So that's what I'm guessing. But no matter what, after Thanksgiving break, all my classes are getting moved to online because they don't want people going home, seeing their families, possibly going on vacation for Thanksgiving break and then catching the virus or the flu and coming back and spreading it around campus we are online after thanksgiving break but as of now i still have three classes in person but like i said leave a comment down below if you are online or if you are in person this upcoming semester whether you're in high school college middle school whatever it may be just leave a comment down below because i am curious to see what you guys are doing as well and that's my ted talk for the day so am i gonna be able to go people because i've been waiting for like 20 minutes my city is kind of big we have like a population of 100,000 people so our traffic at three o'clock right now is actually super bad so it's taking me kind of a while to get there so i'll see you guys when i get to marshall's Okay, we're here at Marshall's and I'm about to go in and get a few things, shop around for back to school shopping. Haul coming soon, make sure to subscribe. Okay, I 
just secured the bag at Marshall's. I'm not gonna show you guys what I got because I wanna save that for my back to school haul where I'm gonna be doing a huge haul from a ton of different stores, thrift stores, actual stores, all of the above, you know what I'm saying? But it's already 3.45 so I'm gonna head home. I'm gonna have my quick 15 minute meeting on Zoom and then after that I'm gonna go thrift shopping with my friend Emily. So we have a full fun packed day. Let's just get going. I'm gonna use this hand sanitizer real quick because I feel disgusting after going in both of those stores. This is actually really good stuff. If you guys have noticed, hand sanitizer has been smelling like tequila recently, but this one's actually really nice and it has aloe in it, so it's making my hands feel super soft. I got it at Target. It's just really mini and cute. I will see you guys back at my house when I drop all this stuff off. I'm leaving my house right now to go pick up my friend Emily and we're gonna go to the thrift store. Sorry, I'm literally crashing because I'm backing up right now out of my driveway. Hey. Hi. Okay, my friend Emily's here and we're gonna go to the thrift store at Valley Village, which is all the way in Racine. I live in Kenosha, so it's like 15 minutes from where we are right now. So I'll see you guys when I get there. Okay, we just got to Valley Village and we're about to go in, so I'm about to mask up right now. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's not enough to see her. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's not enough to see her. There must be something bad features. You'll find her beauty goes much deeper once you get to meet her. You see her walking down the boulevard. She got the posture. Okay, well, we're gonna go check out because they keep playing that message, so. Of a superstar. She looks so fly in those Gucci slides. Okay, Emily and I just got back from Value Village and I got a few things, but I don't want to show you guys right now because I'm going to do a back to school haul of like all the clothes that I'm going to get before school starts. So that is going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was just a little sneak peek into my back to school shopping. And like I said, there'll be hauls and other back to school videos coming soon. Definitely subscribe if you want to. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.